Hi Gemini, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for the month of May. This is for Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for the month of May, Gemini. This may or may not be for you because I can't read for every single person, okay? So it may or may not be, but this is for Gemini. Typically, for me, I watch my Venus sign for love, strength, strength, wonderful. So this is confidence, this is grace, this is, a, this is really facing your fears about a situation. I think that you have the ability to help somebody heal, Gemini. I think that you have that you are probably being sought after or somebody is trusting you to help them. Somebody is seeing your strength or they're seeing your ability to help you help them. It's like you're being trusted. I don't know, that's weird definition for that card but that's what I feel you know when I do the cards I don't go by the typical meaning sometimes I do but most of the time I don't so this is yeah, somebody from the past or somebody that you know this is memories three of cups reversed unhappiness somebody from the past may be unhappy they may be unhappy and they don't want you to move on. They don't want you to move forward. Oh my God, I don't know if that's the case, but the Knight of Wands reverse, like they don't want you to go. Oh my God, so Gemini, you could be dealing with an individual from your past that isn't happy that, you know, they don't want you to move on. They probably see your beauty, they see your confidence, they see your strength. They may see that you're you're helping somebody else as well. They may see that you are working with somebody else. I think that, I don't know, this is a different kind of message. Um, yeah, they don't want you to start over. Somebody doesn't want you to f go in another direction. I'm, that's what this is. They, they, somebody is giving up their stance, G Gemini, you know. They're, they're getting unstuck from their stubbornness. And it's because you're moving on. It's because you're finding your strength and your confidence to focus in another direction. They don't want you to fall in love with somebody else. Interesting. Is that what this is? Don't move on. It's almost like they want to keep you. Queen of Cups reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. And Knight of Cups reversed. Oh my God. Yeah, moving on. They see that you're moving on. You got Gemini. I have to be honest with you. You got you got somebody from your past that doesn't want you to move on, and they don't want you to fall in love. They don't want you to start another relationship. So they don't want you to give your heart and your energy to somebody else. So you got somebody here that is is just like you know. I don't have anything else to prove. This guy. This guy is like. This is my soulmate, and I don't want, I don't want to, I don't want to lose this, this love. I don't want to lose it. I don't want to lose it. So I think that we got somebody here that is seeing your beauty. They're seeing your tenderness. They're seeing what you're worth. And yikes, they don't want you to move on. So I don't know.
We have water. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Boom, 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 boom. Pisces. Um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Aries, Leo. It's almost like they don't, they don't, they are probably hoping for a reunion. But we're going to see what's going on here. Maybe they see you're, you've given up. You're no longer in love with them. <laughs> Queen of Wands reverse. Yeah, there's no more passion left for the situation. There's no more desire. I have no more energy for it whatsoever. Oh, my God. Page of Wands. This is, this is mm, somebody that may be coming in to distract you from your current path. I feel like you've healed. This is a card of healing. You've done a lot of healing, <laughs> and you're probably a healer. So I think that you've done a lot of healing. We have somebody here that is coming to, it's almost like steal your energy. It's like they want it back. They want it back. They don't want you to move forward. They're coming to You know, they, they see you as their wish fulfillment now. And I think that they see that you've lost hope. They th see that you've given up. I think that you are dealing with a person that sees that you are no longer... You don't see them as wish fulfillment anymore. This is losing hope. Lack of ambition. It's like there's no energy. There's no desire. There's no... Attractive. I'm not attracted to this anymore. You've done so much work. You've done so much healing. Now we have somebody here that's pretty immature, obviously. We have somebody here that's pretty immature. Almost like a child, you know, that has been trying to prove a point by withholding love. And now it's their loss. Because and they want to save you now. Now they want to save it. Now they want to save it before it's completely gone. They want to hold on to it. This is a shady individual. This is a, somebody that it wants to come back to get the rest. They want to come back. We have somebody here that uh, may have deceived you. They may have lied to you. They were trying to prove some sort of point, And now they want to come back. This is, this is a deceptor. A liar, a thief. That wants to move forward. They want to bring victory and success to the situation. So I really feel, Gemini, as though you have somebody that hurt you, that cheated you, that lied to you. That now is finding their mental strength to come forward somebody is moving forward in your direction after they lied to you after they cheated you somebody that you know okay it is somebody that you know if you if this could be somebody this is somebody that from your past it doesn't mean that it's somebody that you dated but for the majority of you i think it is but a lot of people get misconstrued when somebody says somebody from the past and they go right back to everybody they've dated. That is so naive. Somebody from the past could be, how many people do you know? Ding, 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 ding. So anyway, this is somebody that you know that is heading in your direction after some sort of deception some sort of lie, some sort of betrayal. Now they want to save it. They want to save the connection because it's like you've given up on the love, okay? You have given up on the love. I mean, that is what this is. You're, you're no longer invested in it. You've healed. And I think that you're helping somebody else now. I think that you're involved with somebody else now.
Ooh. Yeah, this person, now they don't got nothing left to prove. I just want to be happy. They're ready to face their ego. They're ready for a change. They realize that their ego got in the way, and now they want to move forward. It's like they're going to master their emotions. They're going to get in their vehicle, or they're going to move forward very, very quickly in your direction because... I think they see you as the only option or as the best option. Now you're going to have to make a choice. This is You're going to have to make a decision here. And this is a complex decision. Because Gemini, I feel like you have multiple options. Do you want to move forward with this person that betrayed you? Because there's an opportunity for that. I think whoever you're dealing with impulsively got involved in a, another per, with a relationship and probably they regret it. I don't know if that's the case or not, but we have somebody here that did the wrong thing. They took action in the wrong direction or they didn't take any action at all when they should have taken action. Could go either way. They may have seen some other options and made a wrong decision and there's consequences for that because we have something, this is a card of consequences because we have, I think you, but this could be vice versa. Somebody has given up on the love. It's like, oh, this is not love. I'm. This is not it. This is not well suited for me. And they realize that somebody in this dynamic realizes that this is not a good connection. It is not well suited for me. It wasn't a well, it wasn't a good connection. It just wasn't. They may see that you see and you've healed. <clears throat> and now they want to be happy. Now they want to step outside of their ego and, and head in your direction. Ooh, the devil. Yikes. So... This is going to be quite a temptation for you. I think that you are going to be very tempted. You are. You're going to be very attracted to this offer. You are going to be tempted. But you're going to have to follow your intuition, okay? You're going to have to really use your intuition this month. This is a this is a this is a the healer, okay, the high priestess is a healer. The high priestess is a tarot reader. This pe per per person is a spiritual counselor. So you're going to have to just really listen, maybe. I mean, so if this was me, I could ask my cards, but I can't really read for myself, even though I can, but whatever. Um, through these readings, I can, but if I try to do a reading for myself, it's really hard. But through the general readings, there's it's weird. Anyway, um, this is, you know... What you need to do is follow your intuition. You're going to have to, okay, because your answer is going to come. Your answer is going to come to you in regards to which path that you should take. I feel like oh, there's some secret. Somebody has been keeping a secret, and I think that you know it, and I think you know exactly who this person is. I feel like... You're probably going to have to take a minute to think about this, to, 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 to reflect and go within to come up with the uh, right answer, okay? Because you're going to be tempted by something that may not be good for you, okay? It may not be good for you. There's definitely a strong attraction to it, so... Be careful. You could be dealing, you need to be careful. Be really careful because you're going to have to make a complex decision this month whether you want to move forward with an individual that may have betrayed you. So, uh, this is, the, I mean, this, I don't know if this was reversed or upright. We have the death card on the bottom. I've moved the deck from this hand to this hand. So, in this case, I'm just going to put it upright. This is the end of a situation. Okay, this is the end. I think that you have reached the end. I think that you are leaving behind somebody that perhaps you just know they're not a good fit. And, they, and I think this person is probably going to come after you. 
That's what I think. That's what I think is happening. I think this person, you know, is in love. They're hurt, and they're gonna. You, you're deciding that it's over, and now they're deciding to master their emotions, drop their stance, stop being stubborn, and move forward. <laughs> you will have every sign here. Okay, every single sign is here. We have a lot of water here. Like I said, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. These are all people. So we have Cancer here. We have Capricorn. We have everybody. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have Aquarius. We have Leo. Everybody is here. It doesn't really matter. But it's like somebody wants to save this relationship because they see that you are healed and probably helping somebody else or you're with somebody else. So that's what I see. Good luck, Gemini. I think that you're going to have to uh, make a complex decision as to whether you want to... Uh, bound yourself to this person or not does this person have good intentions does this person have good intentions that's what i would like to know whoever this person is that is moving forward very quickly what are their intentions Whew. they may they may uh leave you in the cold so be careful be really careful. They they may not really have anything solid to offer you. You're really going to have to just take a time out and think about this. Take time to think about this. So I feel like you're going to have to really, really go within to become consciously aware of what action that you should take because you are going to be tempted by a very attractive offer and it's because you have given up you've given up you've given up there's like there's no more love you've given up on the connection and boom here they are good luck i don't know i don't know who this is for it may or may not be for you and again, this can be vice versa. Somebody is deciding to move forward very quickly. I'm going to master my emotions. I'm going to replace this fear with faith because I'm losing it. I'm losing this love. I'm losing the connection. It's kind of like, and I don't know if this is a narcissist from your past, but you think about a narcissist losing their supply. I don't see a narcissist here in this reading. I don't. I don't see any of those cards, but that just popped into my head. I don't know why, you know, um, but I don't see a narcissist here. I don't see any cards that shout narcissist. I don't see that. I feel like we have somebody here that is realizing that they have lost a love connection and it's like they get this. awakening that I gotta go I gotta go so anyway anyway and they're gonna come with something solid so they do have good intentions I just happened to look on the bottom they are coming with something solid I know that it's been a long time waiting or whatever, but it may be too late. I don't know if it is too late, but whoever is coming, they are coming with, with something, you know, stable. It could last. They thought about it. It's practical. Something you could, you know, hold on to. So this is a, something that is, whoever this person is, they do have good intentions. But there has been betrayal. There has. And you're going to have to follow your intuition. I mean, you could end up being left in the cold. Okay, this is the five of pentacles. You could be end up be, be, being ghosted. 
So really take a time to go within and listen, listen to your inner guide. Take time to just be silent and, and make the decision that, you know, let the messages come to you. And you have to do this in silence. So when you are faced with this complex decision, whatever it is that you're going to, you are going to be faced with a complex decision this month. And this is a victim. You, you know, be careful. You don't want to let yourself become victim to a toxic situation. Be careful. You don't want to let yourself become victim to a toxic situation. Be careful. Become victim. Toxic situation. Be careful. Just be careful. So Gemini, there is an opportunity. I think you are going to receive, there's forward movement. You probably are going to receive some sort of, somebody may come to your house or they, who knows, they may communicate with you or something that, they made a poor decision. I don't know. Good luck. <laughs>